Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 4 of Adobe Animate CC tutorial series. So today we're going to look at how to adjust panels and workspaces, zooming and resizing uh, animate elements. So for this lesson, just use the Action Script 3.0 and once you start it, you actually have a default uh, level of uh, canvas size right here. So you, if you want to change the size, let's say for example, you want to uh, change the size to SD, what you can simply do is you can go to uh, Windows, let me just go over here, and then in the workspaces, uh, let me just press reset essential so that it goes back to the default workspace right there. You can go to Windows, you can go to workspaces, go to animator, and you can see that it goes to the animator panel right here in the classic uh, flash like environment and you can also I prefer uh, selecting the essential uh, animation option right here so over here you can also see that there's developer mode where it gives you options for developing for components it gives you user interface options like buttons and so forth uh, as you can see right here so over here what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stick back on to uh, my essential windows panel right here all right and over here there's within height so on the within height section you can see that you can adjust the frame rate you can adjust the size and so forth so over here uh, frame rate 24 is for videos for film uh, frame rate if you want to stick to pal then it is 25 frame frame rate and then ntsc is 29.97 and if you want full-on uh, smooth animation then you go for 60 frames per second usually i like to have this as tw at 24 frames per second uh, which is the traditional film based uh, animation speed and then if you want to go for traditional animation um, uh, frame rate then it is actually 12 so this is actually used for frame by frame animation as you don't want to draw too many frames and avoid making uh, too many frames uh, for traditional animation so just do 24. All right, for the size, I'm going to press 10A, um, uh, 1920, uh, and then height will be 1080, and then this is actually uh, what canvas size is like. So let me just press Alt and zoom out, and you can see that there's the canvas size just like that. All right, so over here, this is the traditional, uh, uh, this is the uh, SD uh, size right here, 1920 by 1080 and you can also do scale content and go for advanced settings to actually set other options right here. So you can use inches as your um, option, you can use decimal inches, you can use point centimeters, millimeters and so forth. So you can see that you can change the um, uh, width and height um, um, in measurement as well. So I'm just going to stick to pixels because that is what is used traditionally uh, by computer animation. So over here, this is how you zoom in and out. So just hold control, zoom in and out. And over here, you can see that if you were to press this, then it goes back to center stays. So let's say, for example, you go down, you want the, the canvas back onto the center. You just press the center stays button just like that. And over here, you can see there's 100 and so forth. So you can uh, fit in window as well. And something that you notice with a flash is that you can actually draw outside of the uh, animation uh, canvas and if you were to pr press this it'll clip the content and if you were to press this again it'll unclip the content so let's say for example you have a lot of animations so if you are doing animations you, you might see that everything is outside of the canvas so you can see that this is a lot more like illustrator so photoshop is more like after effects and illustrator is more like flash so you can uh, draw uh, things out of the um, out of the canvas over here and to clip it just click on the clip content outside and then it'll clip all the contents and keep it inside so you can see that you can actually bring in the shapes just like that and all of the shapes are actually still there so this is how the canvas works and if you want to resize the element you can simply resize the within height of it and scale the content as you wish so this is how adobe animate uh, file works Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.